Hey YouTube, well today we have a long overdue update on my 2008 Lexus IS250. And over here, we have my partner in crime, who is uh, obviously getting into the video here. But, um, it's been about two months since I've given you an update video. The last one would have been when the water pump exploded on her, and had to get that fixed. So that was a nice um, $800 charge there at the Lexus dealership. And then, as soon as it got home from the dealership, my dad and I went ahead and changed the rear brakes. We got the uh, um, uh, new brake pads, and of course we um, we didn't put new rotors on, but we did rotate them. Sorry, as Mr. Cool Dude and his dually drives by. But I just washed it all up yesterday, and of course it's been sprinkling, so it's got a little few spots on it. And I had to park kind of in a muddy parking spot earlier. So the tires aren't exactly the cleanest like they were yesterday, but you can see I've had these tires for 10,000 miles now, and they are wearing pretty well. I think I'll get about 15,000 miles more out of them, and then I should have to get new ones. Um, of course, all the rock chips still here are here, and the uh, remnants of where I hit an armadillo, and the nice scratches along the side, but... So after the water pump thing, that was that it um, hasn't no, not too much else has, else has happened after that um, because the car hadn't been driven a whole lot this summer. Um, we uh, have a few new videos that should be coming along the way. Um, one of a rental car we had a 2014 Toyota 4Runner that'll be coming soon. Um, an 05 I think CRV EX five speed manual will be coming. 07. Toyota RAV4 Limited, and then a 99 Volvo S70 will be coming. But I did want to give you guys an update video here right before um, the miles started coming on this car. We'll go ahead and do an... I don't know what this is right here. I need to get that off. But cleaned out the inside yesterday. Um, and as you guys remember, got, I remember I have the windows tinted, I uh, got the WeatherTech floor mats, and that's about all I've done to the car besides get tires and oil changes and put gas in it, which I just did put gas in it this morning. But put your foot on the brake and hit the engine start button. And you can see 77,417 miles. So it has just been about 2,000 miles since you saw it last. 2,000 miles in about two months, so that is low for me, 1,000 miles a month. I usually do a lot more than that. Um, but as I said, we were kind of, we were gone. I was gone for about a month and a half. Um, but that being said, today is Monday, and this Wednesday, this car is leaving on a road trip to Maine. Uh, there and back, it's, I believe it's, I believe it's going to be a, about 3,500 miles round trip, um, I think. And so I am planning on getting an oil change along the way. I don't know where yet, but I'll be going from here in um, middle Georgia uh, to up through um, Augusta, Georgia, Columbia, South Carolina, um, uh, over to Interstate 95, Florence, South Carolina, and then headed up 95 through Richmond, um, D.C., all the way up through New York City and obviously to, through to Maine. Uh, and then back down, but I'm going back down another way so I can go through Charlotte and some other places. I'm going to try to hit, visit as many Lexus dealerships as I can. If you follow me on Facebook, you know that I'm trying to uh, see them all. But we'll be taking this car, my dad and I, up to Maine. It should be up for the task. I don't see why it wouldn't. Water pump's just been changed. Uh, and there will be plenty of uh, places to get it fixed if anything were to happen. I don't think it will, but we'll go ahead and... Um, Open the hood, go down the window, and we'll open the trunk for the heck of it. I haven't given you guys a tour on this in a while. Um, just not much has been going on with it. Just some stuff in there. Of course it's going to beep at me because the key's left leaving the inside of the car. One day, I really need to get this hood repainted because it's just kind of road rashed all up. But, let's see the 2.5 liter V6. I 
think I'll have to get a new battery somewhere along the lines, maybe at 90. You can hear the direct, inje the direct injection ticking away back there. And I've got a little bit of oxidation up here in the corners. And you've got your daytime running lights over there. Rear seat in here. And so with that, that's just about all I needed to update you guys on. I figured I'd show you the car since I haven't done that in a while. But, um, stay tuned for more. And, uh, if you can think of any places to stop along the way to Maine, off 95, then shout it, shout it down in the comments. Um, plan on stepping it south of the border, uh, just south of North Carolina. And then obviously a few Lexus dealerships along the way. So, thanks for watching.